Hi, Bright Play Pals. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. And if you're new to our channel, click that red subscribe button, ring that notification bell so you get updates anytime we upload new videos. So today we are taking a look at more LOL Surprise OMG fashions where I created my own looks with different things that I've collected for my LOL Surprise OMG dolls. So without any further delay, let's go ahead and check these looks out. So the first look we have here is Swag guys and she is part of our girl gang. And so Swag has on these little pants right here with the little shirt tied around the waist. And it actually came from one of my Na 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 Surprise dolls and I think that looked cute on her. I love the little rip like frayed edges on the jeans. I think that looks really cute on those shorts. And of course she's got on her traditional little swag socks. And so these boots, they actually are all girls boots. And this is the look that we have for swag. So now we have Dazzle guys. And first of all, her hair, I actually uh, put it in a little like hot water to straighten it out because I wanted to make sure it was nice and long and flowy. And look how long her hair is guys. It is so, so, so long and beautiful and she, her earrings that she has on belong to crystal star this little top i got it from haunt couture this is this jacket that she has on and so this skirt i thought it went really well with the shirt because it's so shimmery and it belongs to cosmo nova that's who she borrowed it from and these little boots of course i know you recognize the boots and so this is the look that we have for dazzle so this of course is my girl neon licious i think she looks so cute her little hat that she has on the little hat with the hair i actually borrowed it from one of my non and non surprise dolls to give her a different look the rainbow hair looks fabulous on her and then we've got the candy licious top and these little jean shorts she actually borrowed them from one of my uh mini mouse fashion packs and one of those dolls so that's cute and these little boots i got online because i wanted some pink little uh, like timberland boots and i've been using them and i think they're really really cute and so the little purse came from one of my snapstar dolls and i thought it went great with the little look that i had going on for neon licious so this is angles so i thought that little outfit looked great on her it brought out the pops of color so it just is a really cute little casual look for her i kind of ruched up the, the pants a little bit kind of bunched them up right there and then these boots guys these are some monster high little ankle boots and i just thought that they were cute and so that is the look that i created for angles cosmic nova gave her a new hairstyle she has on so many different things this is royal bee's necklace the little outfit she has on is from sparkle girls i use a lot of their stuff this little belt i bought online and a bunch of things uh just doll accessories and these boots guys i love them love the little fringe on them so so cute and so this is a very cool look that i have for cosmic nova and you see i gave her some lashes and i do that sometimes for my dolls so guys let me know what you think about this look now Snowlicious, love her purple hair, and I pulled her hair back in this outfit with a little bracelet that I used like a headband. And this, I mean, head to toe, this is so cute. So this little top I got from Han Couture in one um, purchase that I made. And then I also got this little skirt and I paired them together. They're separates actually, if you look at them. But I did create this look for her. I made her a cute little blinged out necklace, which I think is awesome. Looks good on her. So she's got cute little pearl earrings. And so these boots are like monster high, monster ever after high boots that I got. And so I created a little two finger ring for her. And I think this look is so cute and I just love the skirt. It's probably one of my favorite little pieces that I have right now. Love it, love it, love it. So I, you know, for those of you who have been with me since the beginning, you know, one of the dolls that I got, I think the very first doll I actually got was Teacher's Pet. And everyone is can't wait until they get the uh, uh, big sister to Teacher's Pet. So anyway, I made my own little kind of Teacher's Pet. This right here is Neon Licious and she's got on this little like skirt or whatever it doesn't fit her perfectly but I still thought it was cute I gave her a little yellow bow the bow came from one of my boxy girls but I thought that that looks really cute on her it popped the color out so well um, you could really see her yellow eyeshadow so I love that and her socks that she has on are actually all girl socks and then she has on some monster high like skates and these little skates are so cute so so cute so anyway that is the look that I came up with um, I guess my own little teacher's pet inspired look for Neonlicious. 
Now, Speedster looks amazing. She always looks amazing. Her makeup is like so, I mean like her foundation. It looks so, so cute. And for those of you who have her, you really know how beautiful her face is. It just really is so cute. And the look that I gave her, it was kind of like a Madonna inspired material girl look. I love the pink and the black together. Uh, this actually is a Barbie top that I got in like a holiday Barbie, um, it's a, um, advent calendar that I got from Barbie. That's where I got this top and the little shrug as well. And I paired it with alt girls little like boussier dress and I kind of did it almost like where it looks like a skirt. But this shrug is so cute the way it just kind of wraps around her. So I love it and it really makes her lipstick pop. Uh, you can really see the color of her lips really well and her eyeshadow and everything because of this pink It is great I actually have a black earring like this, but somehow I lost it. I don't know where it is I gotta look for it I think I dropped it somewhere when I was preparing uh, to show you guys But she does have a black earring just like that um, that I had on the other side these little shoes They're like very vampalicious just love them They're not a perfect fit, but I think they're really good for the look and so this is the look that I created for speedster so Candy Licious is so pretty, such a pretty, pretty girl. I love her colors. Everything looks great. Whenever I see her, she's just very, very cheerful. And I created a little different look for her. So right now she has on a Barbie outfit. And I think all the pastels and stuff really go well with her, you know, makeup and her hair and everything. I put a little flower right there, which I think also is so cute. I love the little sparkles in the flower too. And her shoes are boxy girl shoes and I thought that they actually were cute. So this is the look that I created for Candy Licious. So alt girl, here she is. She actually has on a no 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 surprise hat that also has the hair attached. Um, I actually took it off the no 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 surprise doll like I do with sometimes like and make it like an accessory. I just love the purple hair on her. I thought it looked great, especially when you look at her lip color. I thought it was perfect and this little top that I got is, I can't remember, it's, oh, this little top I actually got in a lot of doll clothes that I purchased, and she has on the stockings and the little boy shorts that belong to Uptown Girl, and these shoes are some Monster High shoes that I have, and I love them. I love the, the little detail and stuff on the back. So, so cute. So this is Royal Bee, guys, and I have this version of her. I have another one where I didn't actually have three of them, but this one, I actually took her hair, made it loose, kind of twisted it up and made it like a big curly fro. So I love the little messy hair look for her. And what I did was I created a little like a deep V neck little um, kind of rhinestone studded top. Um, she has on Snowlicious's uh, little pants. So I'm not a big fan of the bell bottoms of these pants the way they come. So I ruched them up a little bit and created kind of like a little bunched up look. And I also put some bling on her shoes to kind of match her top and the little bracelet that I created right there for her. But this is a look that I have for Royal B and I really like it a lot. So you guys let me know what you think about it in the comments below. So this is the last look that I have guys and I posted um, on my community page and also on my Instagram that she said yes to the dress and this right here is Uptown BB guys. And let me tell you, she looks fantastic. She actually has an address that I got from Haunt Couture. Really, really cute. Love this dress guys. Fits like a glove. Love it, love it, love it. And I just created a little more bling here in the front of the dress and then I gave her some blingy earrings and I just love this little ring. And so the ring actually is a Barbie ring. And what I did was I swapped her hand out with another doll, Dolly. I think it's Dolly's hand because Dolly couldn't wear a ring. And I just took the Barbie ring and put it on Dolly's hand and swapped out the hands for Uptown BB. So for those of you who don't know, one of the tricks with the LOL Surprise OMG dolls is their hands come off. It really makes it, you know, I do it all the time when I'm trying to style my dolls because some outfits, it's really hard to get it on with their hands because their hands are so pliable and bendy and stuff. So I, I often take them off, but you can also swap them out if you have dolls that have similar skin tones. I do that from time to time if I want an additional accessory. And so this is the look that I created for Uptown Girl. So guys, that's all the looks that we had for today. And you guys let me know in the comments below what you think about all of these looks that I created for my LOL Surprise 
OMG dolls. I'm going to continue to do more videos like this. I think you guys enjoy it. If you are not following me on Instagram, go ahead and check me out there as well. So you will see in real time some of the styles that I create for my dolls throughout the week. Um, and if you have any comments or if you know any items that I probably should try to get for my dolls, let me know and I'd be happy to check them out because I'm always looking for ways to keep styling them. But let me know in the comments below which look was your favorite. And for me today, it is a tie. I must say that I love Uptown Girls look and I also love Royal Bees look. These are my two faves. These girls are shining, glittery, glamorous, and I love both of them. But you guys let me know which one was your favorite in the comments below. But that's all we had today from Instant Ride Play. But before we go, I just wanted to say, even if you have a hard day, we hope you find some time to play. And we'll see you next time on Instant Ride Play. That's why.